I'm finally back at my Q16 Bernina sit-down machine and I'm putting on my little garden gloves here that have the little grippies on the hands and getting ready to start this little practice piece. This little bit I sped up by six times because I was sitting there trying to decide what to quilt. <laughs> so yeah, I had a little bit of a, you know, brain freeze for a minute and then I decided to do this flower garden flower vine so I'm just doing a giant meander here for the vine nothing is drawn out or decided ahead of time I'm just doing this kind of on the whim and in a second here I'll show you uh, my other camera angle I just wanted to show you what it looked like sitting at the machine and here we go with the nice close-up so you can see exactly what it is I'm doing. And it's been a little while since I've been at the sit-down, so I was pretty excited after doing this piece how comfortable I felt, because it has been a bit, and I think I'm getting the hang of it, so I'm pretty excited to uh, get some courses out soon for the sit-down. And in this design, I'm just doing all kinds of leaves and flowers and little curly cues. And there's no real rhyme or reason. I'm just mixing it up and putting in whatever I think fills the space nicely. So I hope you enjoy this bit. And we'll talk a little bit later in the video. thought you guys might find this funny. Uh, my husband got home when I was in the middle of filming this and this is what happened. I'm filming. It's your garden gloves? Yeah. <laughs> I don't think you get through here. No I'm filming. Sorry. For the inconvenience. I just think it was really funny uh, you know we all have these crazy busy lives and you know I've got my husband and four kids that all still live at home here and my other son had walked kind of behind my filming area and you know life is crazy and funny and things happen and he my husband literally could not get through because I have my sit down just in this tiny little space right by the door for him to come in and I had my camera set up and the backdrop and all of that so he had to go outside and back around to the other door but things happen you know I'm just a real life person just like everyone else and uh, I just thought it was a little comical but I do love this sit down machine when I know I'm not going to be using it. I can fold up the table and stick it away in a smaller space. And I just love that aspect of this machine. So if you don't have a lot of room, uh, this would be a great option to get the folding table. And I'm just going to keep quilting along here. 
and coming up with these different flowers and vines and leaves. And this was really a fun little practice piece. I have another half of this fabric that I'll be doing another video soon. And please let me know if you have any questions and I will do my best to answer those.
There were a few times when quilting this piece that I just let up on the foot pedal just because I wasn't consciously thinking about it and so the stitching would stop. But I think that's just a little bit of inexperience. And so I hope you enjoyed this video and seeing uh, the different camera angles and just I am trying to relax my shoulders and wrists and uh, just lay my hands kind of flat on the fabric. So here is that finished piece. Here's all the settings that I was using. Regulated mode, the BSR-1. And what a fun little design. You get to be creative and it's very forgiving. So I hope you love it. And thanks so much for watching.